What's going on guys? Thanks for checking out this video. Uh, like the title stated, going to be doing a little bit of crappie fishing today. Got this bridge behind me that I'm going to start off on. Get away from the sun here so you guys can see a little bit better. But we're going to start on this bridge, fishing some bridge pilings out here on the river. Uh, scanned around a little bit. I've seen a few crappie out here on these pilings, so we're going to go ahead and uh, get rigged up. Got some of the big camera dots so switched over to the phone. Uh, but like I was saying, picked up some of these little crappie jigs. Uh, these are like little swim baits. Going to rig them up on a jig head and uh, kind of drop them around these bridge pilings back here on this bridge. I'm going to be using the Garmin Live Scope right here to kind of find where they're at on this bridge. Uh, hopefully we can get on a few right here on the Live Scope and show you guys exactly what these crappie look like on the bridge pilings. Got this little crappie jig. Not really a big crappie fisherman, haven't really done it, so if I can catch them on this live scope off of this bridge with what I got, just my normal bass gear, then we'll be doing pretty good. There he is. Oh yeah. That's a good crappie right there. Whew. Saw a group of them on the live scope there. Just jigging it up and down, I can kind of see them moving around there we go that's probably i think i'm only like five minutes in nice crappie right there hopefully we can catch quite a few of these would love to fry a few of them up for dinner tonight that's a good one right there for sure there he is <laughs> little guy uh i think i don't think there's really a size limit so we'll throw them in the well if we get a few bigger ones i'll probably end up letting him go but uh, let me let me grab the big camera and show you guys. There is a group of them down there. All right, check that out. Right there, those are all crappie sitting off of that bridge piling. Just dropping that little swim bait jig down there and uh, jigging it up. I can see my bait on there. I just kind of throw it through there, jig it a little bit, see how the fish are reacting. And I've been able to catch two so far off of that school, so. Looks like there's quite a few, quite a few down there. Yeah, yeah, oh my gosh, look at all of those. Yeah, we're about to smash them. There he is. So that guy sitting in between the bridge pilings, cast it over, was just reeling it. <laughs> Decent one, not as big as the few of the ones we've been catching, but we'll take them. There he is. Saw that big group of them right off that piling. Looks like they're just moving around. Haven't really been able to stay right on top of a group, but dang, that is another big crappie right there. Check that guy out. That's the kind you want right there. See if I can get back in that group right there and get another one of them before they move off on me again. Good thing with that live scope is scan around a little bit and find them. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Check that out. Let's see if you guys. See that before getting another cast in there? Check out those crappie right there. That is a group of them. So cool. <laughs> just watch that jig go down. Just see all those fish just go right down on it. I'm gonna see if I can't set up a my other GoPro to maybe show you guys what I'm looking at over here. But yeah, they're just still loaded up. Let me try to catch a few of these before they move on me. And if they're gonna stay still. 
set up the, the other GoPro and see if we can't get some nice footage. But yeah, they're they're all over the jig. Oh. Come on, get Nice size ones too. There we go. Gonna be cooking up some nice crappie tonight. I mean, look at that. I mean, these are all really nice size crappie right there. Tell him. In. Uh, let me go ahead and get that other GoPro set. See if I can't get that other GoPro set up for you guys right here. Since we're on this nice little school of them. All right, hopefully they didn't move too much on me in the few minutes it took to get that set up. No, looks, well actually, they did move on me. Looks like we can still catch a few. Let me see if they're on that piling that they were, yeah, see. I, I don't know much about crappie fishing, but I guess they move around a little bit. They were all off of one of these pilings right here, and now they're kind of just out suspended in the middle of this bridge. There's a few of them right there. Let's see if I can't get my jig over top of them. That wasn't any good. All right, there goes my jig. All right, right at their level right now. Let's see if one doesn't come pick it up. Ooh, be right on top of them right now. Yeah, they, these guys are, they're moving quite a bit. All right, there we go. There goes my jig. And we are right on top of them. See my jig popping up there. Might be catching on to me here. Let's see, there's a group there on the bottom. Let's see if those guys, if I can get one of those guys to bite. I get the GoPro out to show you guys and they don't want to cooperate now. There he is. On the blade bait. School kind of that's a good one too. Don't come off. The uh, school kind of separated. So, covering some water with this blade bait. Pick one up, see if we can't catch a few more. I think that's number seven. I'm gonna try to catch like 10 fish if I can today. Be a decent amount to take home. There he is. Man, these are all really nice crappie. <laughs> Calm down, buddy. Number eight right there, I think. Catch about two more. And then we'll probably do a little bass fishing. <laughs> so cool went right by that piling saw my blade bait coming through Ooh, that might be the biggest one of the day right there saw my blade bait coming through and uh, saw this guy chase it right on up and slam it yeah that's a that might be one of the bigger I don't know I've caught some nice size crappie today for sure but that's a pretty good one right there
There he is. Killing this blade bait now. Now that they're not so grouped up, they seem to really like this blade bait. I can cover a lot more water with it. Just bring it right on by those pilings for them. All right, guys, thanks for sticking around and watching this video. Got on some really nice crappie out there today off of this bridge right here. Really exceeded my expectations. Like I said, never really crappie fished. Uh, if you're new to the channel, I pretty much put out bass fishing videos. If you're not new to the channel, you know what I do. But really wanted to get out on some crappie. We've got a little bit of cooler weather. Uh, I've been up to Tennessee, crappie fished a little bit. Really love eating crappie, so those are definitely gonna go home for dinner. I uh, appreciate you guys watching. Hopefully we got some good live scope footage for you guys to see. I uh, just want to say you don't need live scope to come out here and catch these. Uh, I don't think they'd be that, that difficult to catch without it. Just get on the bridge pilings, drop down your jig, drop down your minnow, whatever, and you'd probably catch just as many. Uh, that live scope just makes it really easy to line up on them. You see exactly which bridge piling they're set up on and uh, you can see your jig and everything right on there. So it makes it really easy, but definitely don't need to go out and spend that money for one. Uh, if you don't have the money to buy one, definitely not a necessity. You can get it done without it for sure. I know a lot of guys that don't have it that come out and slay the crappie. So don't feel like you need to buy one of those, but it's definitely really cool to have on your boat. But if you guys like this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel for more content, and we'll see you at the next one. Yeah.